Emma is an amazing person and she's got so much to offer, but mostly Emma just brings so much joy. She's very giving. <laughs> very, very, very caring. Yeah, I love her. I classify Emma's uh, like, Yeah, I don't really see it as a job. I see it as a, um, a mom. <laughs> She's my buddy. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Emma's autism significantly impacts the way she's able to communicate. Uh, um, ability to participate in daily living skills. What? Communication can be a challenge for Emma if she doesn't have her close network around her to help support those interactions in the community. You get your trolley and then we go to the shops. Um, Emma's got really good relationships with people in the stores and they know her really well and you know them. So important for Emma to have those social interactions in the community and I think with just a little bit of compassion uh, and understanding about autism, it would significantly improve Emma's quality of life. Oh, you can see the red light. That means it's on, it's filming us. This is Emma's new communication device. It's got a really wide range of words within the device mm -hmm. and it can be edited and updated to suit Emma's interests at the time. My name is Emma. I like cooking. So this really expands Emma's ability to communicate with the world around her. <laughs> she can take this device to Mama. volunteering, to the gym, Mama. to the shop's home, to mum's. Um, and it's a really great tool to expand that communication. Just having the awareness in the community is so important for everyone with autism. I feel my role is independence, like to help Em live independently within her home. To have that social interaction really improves <laughs> qual Emma's quality of life. Thank you. Bye. Thank you.